Oh, hey guys, sorry I had to take care of something in there for just a minute. Uh, welcome to our first episode of Freaks and Geeks of East 3rd Street. This is a show that's going to tell us a little bit about our school, introduce us to some people we may not know, share some memories, just overall celebrate who we are, the Chang'e School for the Arts and Sciences. So let's head on down this way. Oh, and by the way, throw your trash away like you tell me. Keep the school clean. Welcome to our Art Showcase, where I will be interviewing different artists from around CSAS. Today, I'm with Kristen Tolbert. Hi, I'm Kristen Tolbert. So, what class are you in currently for art? Well, currently, I'm in Independent Studies, and for Independent Studies, you have to submit an application. In order to get in, you have to be, well, they have to accept you and approve of it. And luckily, I was approved, so you know, I paint whatever I want or whatever I'm in the mood to do. So how long have you been doing art? I have been doing art for many years, painting and drawing, but in school I've been painting ever since sixth grade. What inspired you to make this piece? Well, I really love flowers and painting flowers or drawing flowers. And this is my favorite flower, the Stargazer Lily, and everything about it is just so beautiful. The colors and the contrast of everything. So, what is your painting process? My painting process, first I have to find an idea that I want to paint, and then I get my canvas and what you usually do is you prime it first but this was already painted on so I just start to etch it out or sketch out the flower itself with the paint and then I would go in and like go in and add the details to it later and you just add in all like the really fine things afterwards. If you could have anyone as in a celebrity or someone you look up to buy your art who would it be? Well, this is very easy for me. I want my piece to hang up in Eminem's house, my favorite rapper. Not only is he a beautiful person, but he deserves beautiful artwork. And I want him to be able to write a song about it and just stare at it for days. I really love your painting. It's the bomb. I really love your painting and I hang it on my wall. And next, we have a skit by a fourth grader and third grader. And this is called Where's My Homework? Wait, where is my homework? <laughs> Do you still have that candy in your backpack? Yeah, go look. actually a required class. Back in my day, the freshmen weren't lame because we were them. Back in my day, Amato Waycott didn't have an afro. Back in my day, college trips were actually fun and we stayed overnight. Back in my day, Common Core wasn't that common. Back in my day, Ms. Beller actually taught us. Back in my day, we used to actually eat lunch in the front lawn. Back in my day, we didn't have to worry about clown attacks. Back in my day, there was only one Dragoo. Back in my day, there was only one SAT. Back in my day, the library was actually quiet. 
Hey guys, hope you enjoyed our first episode of Freaks and Geeks of East Third Street. See you next time. See you next time. See you next time. Do you mind?